Hello everyone, this is Ami Diamond from Chairpoint Wizard. Let me show you a cool feature uh, now in Copilot Chat. So I'm in Copilot Chat and I will ask a general question, for instance, what's new with Copilot Chat? And I will run it and wait for some reply. And uh, here are the informations that I got. And maybe I will ask uh, some additional thing. Um, I will just uh, write here yes, and I will wait for the reply to, to come. Um, but now notice on top, actually, I have a possibility to add or start a group chat in Teams. So um, let's try this. Let's maybe just wait that it ends. Well, maybe we don't need that. So. Here, actually, I can mention uh, a name, an email, or a tag of people that I want um, to continue the discussion, uh, including I can choose the number of messages I want, up to four. I guess this is what we have. But the more messages you have, you can include. So I will add Alex, and I will add the at. And let's click on create. And what it will do, you see that it says creating group chats and team. You'll be notified when it's ready. So as we can see here, we see the pop-up. We can click on this. And as you see, we can also open uh, the chat. In this case, it's opening it Let's see if it's on the web or on the... So, as you can see, here is the chat with Alex and Liat. And uh, it took, actually, the prompt and added the information. And now we can continue uh, to discuss it with the people, as you can see. We have here the agent uh, co-pilot. We have Alex. We have me and Liat. And here, actually, the chat is continuing. So um, to summarize, what we did was actually to go here and to start a chat. Now, this was on the web. Now, if I go, for instance, to one of these uh, researcher and I will go to the history of one of the things I requested. I see it also exists here. Let's go to the analyst. Maybe for one of the things I asked for it in the last uh, things. And actually, you will notice that for any type of prompt, we, hmm, OK. So for this analyst, or even for this analyst, we have this possibility. And uh, if I go and just look at all of the types of the conversations, you will see no matter what it is, we have the possibility to take the results and continue in the teams. So uh, this is very interesting. Uh, you can see. I could look for, I could maybe put an email of somebody that's not in an organization. But uh, this is the message. And uh, hopefully try it and let me know what you think. So I think it's a very cool feature. Um, so goodbye and see you in the next episode. Goodbye.